Hair has been shoved into a bun, outfit has been changed. I'm just now gonna make some lunch for Nick and I and then I am heading out to Ikea. I just put this pop socket on my phone. I, I filmed a vlog where I mentioned this and then I don't think I put that vlog up. So, hello, new phone. I got the iPhone 13 Pro. Um, it's the first time I've ever got the iPhone, like when it's come out. And it was the least hyped thing ever. I swear, every year when I haven't got an iPhone, everyone's been like, oh my God, the iPhone, the iPhone, the iPhone. This year I was like, oh, well I actually need a new phone, so I'll wait for the iPhone 13. Waited, got it, least hyped thing, like ever. And I just put this pop socket on it. And uh, let me just try and use this pop socket. Oh wait, <laughs> it's popping off because I didn't wipe down the phone case before I put it on. So this is just covered in, specks of dust which is kind of gross i got the new iphone i'm not using it yet though I'm using bits and bobs like i'm using tiktok on it and social media on it because the camera's obviously way better but i'm not fully using it because it doesn't have a screen protector on it we went into town to the apple shop to try and get a screen protector um, and they don't have them in at the moment so i think they got recalled for some reason so i've got my phone i'm still using this one until i've got a screen protector on that one because i just don't feel safe taking it out especially because if you watch the vlog with my previous screen protector you will have I've noticed it was smashed and I don't want that to happen to a brand new phone so I'm taking the phone with me today I'm going to a different Apple shop and I'm hoping that they have some screen protectors in so let's make some lunch let me see if I can sit you in here these make me so happy you can't tell when you glance at them that they're not perfectly straight or perfectly distanced so I'm good with that I would have thought I wouldn't be and I think if it was something that I looked at every day I wouldn't be okay with it, it would really get on my nerves but because it's in the kitchen and you just glance and half the wall blocks it from most angles I'm good with it. I have a freaking spider living in my car and I can't get him out because he tucks away quickly every time I get in the car but every single time he's built a nest in the exact same place, a web sorry, he's built a web and I don't know what he's expecting to catch because there's no flies in here to catch. Poor, poor spider. I almost want to get him out to help him as opposed to get him out because I don't want a spider in my car. But I do worry that one day I'm gonna be driving and he's gonna pop down in front of me, scare the living poop out of me, and I'm not gonna know what to do because I'll be driving. I'm just setting up my phone for sat nav and then we'll be on our way to Ikea. It's an Ikea I've never been to before so I'm hoping, I'm hoping they have what I want and I'm hoping it's a good Ikea because some Ikeas are like a lot smaller than others and they just have a lot less stuff. So I'm just hoping it's a good one. It is a beautiful sunny day. I've actually had to put my sunglasses on because hello sunshine, hello text message. Um, oh, my ASOS stuff has arrived. Okay, so I've arrived at Ikea. The drive was good. I'm gonna turn my car off because it's a little bit noisy. The drive was good, but I was thinking as I was driving and I don't, I'm pretty sure I've mentioned this in a vlog, but I'm just gonna say it in case I haven't. I've switched deodorant. Nobody cares apart from me, but I'm overthinking it. So basically I've switched deodorant so I'm no longer using a deodorant with aluminium in it but aluminium is like one of the main ingredients that stops you physically sweating like it blocks your pores so you don't sweat um so this is the first time i'm not wearing an antiperspirant aluminium containing deodorant and i'm wearing a gray top i i didn't think this through i'm wearing a gray top i have nothing to put over this so if i do start visibly sweating in there which i mean i hope i don't and i shouldn't i shouldn't but if i do that sucks. <laughs> so I just thought I'd update you. But I'm here, I'm at Ikea. Let's go shopping. Hey. It smells of chlorine in here. I miss swimming so much. It smells of chlorine. And I need, I need to sign up to the gym and go swimming. Oh, it smells amazing. This is very cool. So these are basically like the mirrors that I'm gonna buy, they're flat. So they've added LED lights to the back of them to make this. That looks so cool. I need to get lots of knick-knacky pieces, like a random giraffe or something, just to sit on all of the shelves that we've got. This is cute. <gasps> I wonder if they have that. That's quite cute. But I just need all these. <gasps> Look, this is what they've put into a tray. Okay, you know the tray I bought from Primark? I'll get some of these to put in it. And some pebbles, maybe. Okay, this kitchen is dreamy. It's white. Wow, that noise is not dreamy. It's white, there's marble, there's light oak. It's nice and big. It's got a sort of island, not fully, and then straight into the dining room. And I love these lights. 
I don't love that noise. This is beautiful. I think I want this kitchen. <laughs> I want to live here. This is so nice. It's so nicely decorated. How many hobs do you want? Yes. <laughs> That's so cute. Do I buy this just because it's pastel blue? This is adorable. You can buy a photo frame full of mini drones? <laughs> this is very random. Okay, I need to find artwork. I need new artwork and nice artwork. So these are the mirrors that I wanted. <laughs> and these mirrors come as separate mirrors and then you buy the frame. Um, they are out of my mirrors. I am absolutely devastated. Um, but this is what I wanted to create in the hallway. I'm not too sure whether I wanted to go white or black, but they don't have the mirrors in stock. And I'm, I'm just, I'm devastated. I'm absolutely devastated. They also don't have the artwork. Like all of these pictures that you see, and like in these frames, normally you can buy them. There's normally a little section. They only have a section of canvases over here, but no artwork. I don't know if I'm being completely blind, but I have been down every aisle and I cannot find where you just pick up the posters. Goodness, I cannot believe <laughs> what has just happened. I can't believe how bad that Ikea shop was. Not the actual Ikea, obviously Ikea, great. Bloomin' love Ikea. Um, and that particular Ikea, lovely big Ikea, but just, just went in there for picture frames, mirrors, and a chest of drawers. <laughs> Got the picture frames, all grand. They didn't have the mirrors in stock, even though I checked last night, I had the choice between two Ikeas. One was a little bit closer to us than the other, and I looked on there and they had them in stock. They didn't have them in stock today. So no mirrors. The, the main thing that I went for, I went to get the mirrors because I wanted to put them up this evening. I went for the mirrors. Didn't have the mirrors in store. Then as I was walking around, I saw those cute little, they look like Beauty and the Beast, the rose pendulum belly thing shaped glass thing with the plant under it. I don't know what that's called. Couldn't find one anywhere. I also wanted to pick up some artwork. Couldn't find it anywhere. Um, so they didn't have the mirrors. They didn't have the artwork. They didn't have the flower that I wanted, that they had on show, but that wasn't actually in the showcase area for me to pick up on the way out. And then I wanted the chest of drawers. Now they had that in store, they did, but I couldn't lift it, <laughs> graciously enough, to want to bring it to the car. I, I really tried. <laughs> I really tried. I tried lifting it and I know I could lift it. But I was really struggling to lift it and like I got it off the top of the shelf enough to kind of hold on to it and then I pushed it into my tummy and was like hold your dear life. I was holding on to it with my like with my hands and with my tummy for dear life like trying to move it across to my trolley and then I thought if I lower this down I'm going to drop it and it's going to be awkward. So I awkwardly turned back with it and pushed it back up onto the shelf and just left. <laughs> I just left. So I have one photo frame in the back, the little photo frames, but no mirror, no chest of drawers, no plant, no artwork. It was great. I'm so glad I gave up a day of cleaning to come here. So expect me to be going to Ikea in another vlog very soon because I really would like those mirrors. And let me just see how much delivery is. I'm pretty sure something beeping is that me i'm pretty sure delivery from ikea is really expensive four pounds it's four pounds for delivery right okay well now i want to go back in and get the chest of drawers so that i don't have to come back again Ooh. <laughs> do i go back in and get the chest of drawers really awkwardly gonna go back in and try and lift that chest of drawers oh bother That was hectic. <laughs> that was hectic. Guess what the delivery charge is for those mirrors? Oh, like 30 odd quid, isn't it? Four pounds. <laughs> Are you sure? I thought we thought. I thought the IKEA stuff was more expensive than that. It usually is, but those mirrors are just four pounds. <laughs> what? doesn't make any sense. So, I didn't even need to come anyway. Ah! <laughs> 
Okay, thanks for coming to Ikea with me. I'm now gonna sing away on the way home. I should really wash my hands quickly and I will see you when I get home to do some cleaning, to make the place spick and span. Okay, I'm home. Nick had a hard time getting the stuff out of the car for me because I had to I had to reverse into because mum and dad are coming tomorrow they're gonna park in the front so I had to reverse into the driveway only the driveway is not that wide so then once I pulled in we had to open the door only a little bit and try and slide those things out um it was quite difficult Nick can you come and hold this camera for me I bought both photo frames imagine these with mirrors in them because I will be ordering the mirrors so imagine there's mirrors do we prefer, also ignore this arrangement, do we think nine of these black ones with mirrors... They go on up here? There'll be nine. Okay. So imagine another one here, three, three. So yeah. nine black ones or nine white ones. White. I think I prefer the white. Definitely. Do you think? Yeah, definitely. My plant is dying. I'm sure I'm going to get comments like, that plant's not dying if you just feed it, right? I'm not a good plant mum, okay? I'm a poor plant mum. Yeah, terrible. I'm a terrible plant mum, so I'm, I'm, I'm sorry I love you, but see ya. You know when you've got so much to do, you just don't know where to start? I don't, I, there's so much to clean. <laughs> it's like, I, I just, I, okay. I think I'm gonna take my contacts out, put my glasses on so my eyes can relax. Then I'm gonna put on some chill clothes, because right now I have jeans on. So we're gonna take those off. Gosh, it looks so much brighter. I'm so glad I found that setting on the camera. I can't believe it had been on dark for so long. I'm so annoyed. So much of my footage recently has looked so miserable and dark. Um, yes, I think I'm just gonna get changed, put some uh, thingy on, and then I'm gonna go to the office, start there, probably put Grey's Anatomy on the background and try and time-lapse. I'm gonna try and do a time-lapse for you. Am I embarrassed by the state of this room? Maybe, just a little bit. Okay, a lot, but the messier some places, the better the time lapse. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean this place and uh, I've got Grey's Anatomy on this. I keep bringing it up. I'm sorry, I am literally obsessed. I can't stop watching it. So that'll be on there. I will be tidying. I'll see you in a bit. realize this looks like a mess but basically the pile of clothes is what's going into the new chest of drawers along with a lot of other piles of clothes um so I've just folded everything up nicely and left it there and then what's in front of it is some new makeup that I've bought myself and then some PR stuff that I want to put on my Instagram so I'm just gonna leave that there and then as soon as I film that then I can put it away into the bathroom into the cabinet but like there is room in the cabinet for all of that. But until I filmed it, I want to leave it there so that I remember to do it. Um, but yeah, I feel like it's looking a little bit better. I'm gonna go ahead and give the place a hoover and then move on to the next room. So I got the bedroom all cleaned and then we did downstairs a little bit, but dinner's ready. So I'm gonna go have dinner. I think I'm gonna end this video here. I don't think much happened, but I think I'm gonna end this video here and maybe catch up tomorrow because we're just gonna eat and sleep and I'll see you in the morning. Get in here quick! Go, go, go! <laughs> get in! Get in! <laughs> Just get in now! You have to give an extra minute more than anyone else. Yep. Oh, get in! Just, Just jump to bed You won't be able to do it. Oh my God. Jump! Mama's gonna learn the guitar. Oh, that's nice. oh, no, this finger. 
Bow! <laughs> no, no, that one. finger. There, yeah. yeah. Right underneath. That one on the very bottom string. <laughs> you can do it. I'll push down a bit harder. That sound funny. <gasps> Ooh! Now, keep that held yeah. and just try picking them. Picking those strings with your fingers. What do you mean, pick them? Yeah, like this, I'll show you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> This hand's doing this! <laughs> Look at the leg! What's happening with this? <laughs> Look at that! 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 Look at Look at that! Look at I go from that to the deer I showed you. That was good, Dad. Yeah. Yes.